Good morning, good afternoon, good evening guys, wherever you are on this beautiful world, whenever you're watching this YouTube video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel. For the newcomers, my name is Didi, I'm Bitcoiner and I believe in Bitcoin. Um, I'm recording this video inside because it's not early morning, the kids are already playing in the pool, so that's difficult to record something there with the sound. Hope this one is fine as well. Guys, really exciting video really cool charts you need to see these charts before the weekend because it will give you the happy feeling in the weekend guys let's jump quickly into the charts that you really need to see one two three bang i've been running so long that my feet don't work no more oh yeah this is the first chart guys this is the one hour chart on the one hour chart, you can see that the BAM BAM indicator uh, gave a long over there. Then we close the candle above the yellow stepping line over there. That's the second confirmation. We can see the green starting over there. The green at that moment was above the red, also positive. And the BAM BAM crossed the midline, even the top line. This is one, two, three, four, five, six confirmation of taking that trade. That trade would have been a profit of around now we are down a little bit 3.9 percent with a leverage of 10 that's almost 40 percent i expect that we will see a short very soon but we are really bullish in the weekend in the last two weekends so i don't know if i want to take that short if it happens on a friday if you take the short then keep watching the chart because i think it will only go till the level of 45 so it's a few percent profit but I am not going to take that one. I will stay bullish at the moment. Let's jump into the next chart. Oh, yes, I want to show you this one. Look, that's beautiful in Aurox. You have multiple charts all in one screen. So you can share all of this like bam, like that. That's how easy it works. Very important to see is that we are above the 200 day moving average on the daily chart. This is the level that we need to keep support during this weekend we need to stay above that red line the 200 day moving average if we stay above this for a couple of weeks this green line the 50 day moving average is going to go up and cross that red line yes you hear some sounds on the back but that's my wife preparing a beautiful delicious cup of coffee um, and then when we get that cross that will be a bullish sign and we will explode again let's jump into the next chart bam because here on the daily you can see it even better um, that there is a huge area of support now on that 200 day moving average if we break that one then expect the price to go to this green red line around 42 so still not to the 24 that many of you thought and said and i was not agreeing at that moment no First, they laugh at you, and then at the end, they will agree. <laughs> now, guys, let's jump into the exciting part of these charts, because we have some amazing charts, these ones. Bam, over here. This is the first chart. That is an amazing chart. This, of course, is, um, you know, the stock to flow chart created by Plan B. And this one was now shared, I think, by Willy Wu on his um, Twitter, who was stating over there, guys, at the moment, no, I think it was plan B. It was plan B. No, it was not the way it was plan B, guys. He stated, Bitcoin price, the 200 weekly moving average, and the realized cap, they are all moving up. So we have the price and the 200 weekly moving average, that is the dark black line, and the gray line is the realized cap, they are all going up. Now, if you look to left on the chart, look to the left on the chart, where did you see that before? That these three lines were all going up. Exactly, over there. In this part of the bull run, you can see the gray line going up, a little bit sideways, and then again starts to go up. The black line keeps going up. So in my opinion, we are now exactly at these orange dots that are going down and up, and then the gray line goes sideways and then up. That is what we saw over here. A little bit longer than the previous bull run, but a little bit faster than the previous, previous, previous bull run over there. That is what I believe that this chart is telling us. So prepare for a huge run all the way up to 100K. And what is more beautiful to see, bam, over here, this chart is also awesome. I think I need to put my face on the right place over there, just in between all those amazing lines. What are these lines showing you? These lines are showing you and uh, the Bitcoin supply distribution, because everybody's talking about the shock and you know what is all going to happen, supply shock. Now, this is how people are hodling their Bitcoins and who are hodling these Bitcoins. Hmm. A zip of a very hot coffee. Um, the green line, these are the wheels. You can see that? 
they have 1k plus bitcoins that's uh, at the moment so 25 percent and then 20 percent are the dolphins and then we have the octopuses the exchanges is a 0.1 percent of the bitcoin uh, it's like 13 percent of the bitcoin sorry that's how i need to say it some crabs you can see the shrimps the whales now everything on this chart you can see it down here that is the amount of bitcoin that is hold held huddled by these groups if we want to make it a little bit more easy bam then we go to this chart and that one shows you that the middle class people that hold between 10 and 1000 bitcoins is about 37 percent of the comply of the complete bitcoin supply distributions 25 percent is held by wills that's thousand plus bitcoins 18 percent publicly held by entities and 14 percent is um, held by people that own uh, less than 10 bitcoin so the middle class is a huge market at the moment between 10 and 1000 bitcoins and the whales also so these two combined that's already 62 percent which is a huge percent but the distribution is becoming more evenly if you look to back to here there's a huge amount by, held by the whales you know, and, and smaller by the middle class. And now it's it's evolving into a more equal um, distribution, which is perfect for the market, guys. And why is this happening now? In my opinion, why are we seeing this equal distribution? Because of them, this. And that is very simple, because Bitcoin is the next step in the evolution of money, guys. Yes, I told this also to CNBC. We started with barter, then we went into metal coins like gold, and uh, then to the metal coins like silver and gold. Then we went into the paper money, you know, the physical bills. Then we went to plastic cards. Then we went to electronic money like PayPal and all those alternatives. And now we are evolving to cryptocurrency like Bitcoin, Litecoin, Dash, and many other cryptocurrencies, guys. And that is why, in my opinion now, bam, the distribution is more evenly. Because everybody in the world slowly starts to understand and believe the power of Bitcoin, the power of a decentralized peer-to-peer -peer cash that is unconfiscatable and usable by everyone in the world that just has a phone. Guys, that was everything for today. I hope you really enjoyed today's video. If you did enjoy this video or the CNBC articles or one of the other articles that told that I am hiding my stash on tropical islands and all those places. Yes, we, we have some continents where we hold a hardware wallet. Of course we do that because we don't want to have these hardware wallets in my pocket all the time. You know, you need to understand that the evolution of decentralizing the cash will also be an evolution of keeping control and also guarding your capital again. You gave the trust on guarding that capital to the banks and other centralized organizations. And now by decentralizing the monetary system again to grab the power back to the people, you also need to be aware that you need to guard your own capital again. And that is what I'm doing in a maybe strange way to many, but that's our way, you know? It's not better, it's not worse, it's just different. Thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and family, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, and please leave a comment. What do you think about all these charts? I wish you an amazing Friday and an amazing weekend. In the weekend, two lives, a Dutch and an English. So uh, stay tuned to our YouTube channel. Subscribe, subscribe, click, click, click. Thanks, see you tomorrow, guys. Bam!